What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. This is going to be part two of my car tour where I show the inside of my car. I have a lot of cool things in my Honda, so if you have a Honda, stay tuned. But if you haven't seen part one of my car tour, I'll leave a link in the description. Basically, I just show off all the mods on the outside of my car. On the Honda higher trim models, you actually have a key fob that will let you start the car. So let's see it in action. You want to press the lock button and the hold button right here. And the car should start. Nice. This is really good in the winter when you want to heat up your car and start your car before you leave. And the fob key also has the option to open all the windows. So in the summer, it won't be hot. And here is the Honda. Wow. So to actually start start the car, you're gonna have to press the brake and push the start button. So let's do it. But before we do that, I rooted my head unit so it has like an introduction video. So let's see if it plays. So I start the car. And it should play. So my first vlog video, you guys saw an Iron Man intro. So basically I can play any video I want as an introduction video when I start the car. And that is due to Honda Hack. The reason why people have Honda Hack is to get Netflix and YouTube. So the first thing I want to show off is my mirror. It's actually not a mirror, it's uh, two cameras that shoot the back and the front. So right now you're seeing the back, it's kind of dark. But if you do this, here's the back side and here's the front side. And then if you swipe again, here is the front view. Basically, this is kind of like a dash cam and it goes over your mirror and will always record. I got this basically because if there are any accidents that I had, I will always have it recorded. Also, if the camera detects movement, it will start recording. So if anyone's tampering with your car when you're gone, it'll turn on and start recording by itself. So that's a super cool feature. And you have all the files right here. Another cool thing I got from my Honda is all this red trim. Uh, all the items I talk about right now are gonna be in the link down below. Mostly you can find them on Amazon. I think I got this one on Amazon and the trim just makes the car look more sporty. And not only do I have it on the steering wheel and on my dash, but I also have it on these little speaker things in the front and as well as in the back. Not only do I have the trim in red, I also have this carbon fiber trim that you can also get. I think the trims come in carbon fiber, red, or blue, so choose wisely. Here we have a car mount. This is actually really nice because if you get a notification from your phone, you'll see it, and it's always good to have your phone in reach. My Honda also comes with Apple CarPlay, which is really cool. You have Google Maps right here, Spotify, play your music, and your phone. <laughs> no favorites and then you have Apple or not Apple Maps, but Google Maps here. I have a Funko Pop This is uh the Miles Morales one right now the since the PS5 release Miles Morales the Spider-Man game Came with the release so it's super popular right now and I actually really do like enjoy the movie So this is why I got it. So down here. We have the foot pedals I really like it because it gives the uh, Honda a more sporty look as you can see, here's the brakes and here's the acceleration and they just look nice. So I highly recommend you get one. On Amazon, you can also get these like red matte things. And pretty much any slot you have in the in your Honda, you can cover up. See, we have these, we have the cup holders, we have a little tint red, this, the, all. You can have a little cart mat. Inside one. I also have this in my car. Basically, it's a breathalyzer. Just in case I need to. This device will tell me whether or not I can drive or not. So let's test it right now. It is telling me to blow. I will blow. <gasps> and now, it tells me that I am 0.000. .000 because I haven't drink I haven't drank anything so 
that's a good thing. I know it works. <laughs> also, for my steering wheel, I have this steering wheel cover. I'm not sure what the material is made out, but it's micro. It's like some sort of microfiber and in like half leather, so it feels actually really nice in the hands. Also, on the side, I have hand sanitizer. This is pretty self-explanatory. Sometimes my hands get dirty, and I don't want to dirty up the the steering wheel, so that's why I have that. I also recommend you get concave mirrors. Uh, I have, I have it for my left side and my right side. The car does have a camera, but I almost like never use it because I guess I'm so used to used to driving cars in like the 2000s that I always use my my mirrors. But it's here if in the higher trims. This car mat prevents the car from getting dirty, so when you step on it, it doesn't get as dirty. Since my car is white. My car gets mad dirty, so I'm glad to have these. I have them on all four sides here. I'll show you in the back. They're a little smaller on the back, but in the front, they're kind of long. See, front, short. My seats are kind of like this tannish white and black. I, they're okay. The problem is they get dirty really easily. So if I had a choice, I would probably just go on with black, but I'm stuck with this. All right, so here we are in the back of the car. You would think for being a hatchback it would be really small back here but it's actually pretty big or it's big enough for me so i'm standing here at six foot and let me move this camera right here i don't know if you can tell but i have maybe like six inches of leg room and maybe like two or three inches of head height so it's not it's not actually too cramped in here. It's actually really nice. All right, I think that's pretty much it for the interior. Then, so now let's go to the back and show you my favorite part. The hatch. So when we open it, it goes all the way up. Look at all this space. So what do I have back here? So I have this jump starter kit. Basically pretty much, um, it's like a portable jump starter. Oh, it actually says portable jump starter. If your car dies, you can use this to revive it. And not only does it do that, it's also a power bank, flashlight, and wireless charger. It's really cool. Here I have a volleyball net and a volleyball. Here I have my Black Ops case. This Black Ops case has like miscellaneous car stuff. Here's my rain -X to clean my windows. Here's some super glue. I got some Plasti Dip right here microfiber towels not too much to see got some tennis balls in the bag is also some miscellaneous stuff too here's some supreme gloves um, water bottle brackets here's two of them there's the head bracket I think this is like a Walmart one so I don't really use this one yep and that pretty much wraps it up this is part two of my interior car tour so I hope you guys enjoyed if you saw anything you liked in the car I left all the links in the description. So please feel free to browse around and maybe you'll find something you like for your car. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.